Imagine piloting a robot through the vast darkness of the midnight zone. All sorts of animals might catch your eye, but some of the most fascinating are tiny and can be easy to overlook. Bobbing along in the ocean currents a half mile below the surface is a worm like no other. Meet the pig butt worm, Ketopterus pugoporcinus. The team at Mbari first spotted this unusual animal in 2001 and had a tough time determining how to categorize such a curious critter. DNA analysis confirmed we had encountered a new species of bristle worm that drifts through the midwater instead of living on the seafloor. Studying the pig butt worm was no trivial task. This little worm is about the size of a hazelnut, and even using our high-resolution cameras, it took the eagle eyes of our expert biologists to spot these miniature orbs in the massive ocean. Our skilled submersible pilots were able to gently sample them and transport them back to the ship alive for detailed examination. In the lab, we saw that Ketopterus pucoporcinus is segmented, like other bristle worms. But the segments are highly compressed in the front and back ends, while the midsection is greatly inflated, probably to help keep the animal afloat. Ketopterus pucoporcinus casts out a web of snot to capture bits of organic material called marine snow to eat. Mucus is a useful substance for snaring food in the deep sea, where it may be sparse. Numerous other animals get their nutrition this way too. Animals of all shapes and sizes in the ocean perform an essential climate service by taking up excess carbon dioxide from the atmosphere and transporting it down deep in the ocean. These assorted midwater mucus feeders help repackage carbon to sink more rapidly to hungry seafloor communities. Imbari experts are seeking to push the boundaries of ocean exploration and understanding. The pig butt worm is just one of more than 200 new species named by our team and collaborators. We're working to catalog deep sea animals and environments so we can predict how threats like climate change and mining will affect them. The deep sea teems with life and many remarkable species are still awaiting discovery in the dark. Who knows what we'll find next? This is Chris Walls from the Ambari Video Lab. If you'd like to learn more about the amazing animals of the deep, follow Imbari on YouTube.